attempt to set up a new Google Voice account. I have about 10 already. But I'm logged into my Google account. I'm going to log into a different one. My property mob, Google Voice. So, from here, I'm going to get a voice number. And I want a new number. I do not want to use my mobile number. Now, previously entered my cell phone number here. And... It wants me to verify it. It's going to call my phone. And I'm entering the code. Okay, so I verified my phone number. And I'm going to get a new phone number now. Let me see if I can get mob. Hey, I can. So I'm going to get 904-242-MOB9. That's going to be the property mob phone number. And that's it. I've successfully set up a Google Voice number. And the number is 242-6629 or 242-MOB9. And I'm going to finish. Now I'll just show you um, a few settings that you can change in your Google Voice account. I don't want mine to ring to my cell phone. I just had you have to enter that. Um, it, it requires a, a phone number to be attached to the account. But um, some of the settings here, let me see which ones I want to show you. I want to enable do not disturb. That means it's not ever going to ring my phone or ring on my computer. All calls will go straight to voicemail. It'll send me uh, an email if I miss a call. And let's see, my voicemail. I'll record a new greeting here in a little bit, but right here, the voicemail notification, I'm going to check the spot, make sure that's checked. I want it to email the message to me. So that's pretty much... You know, you can go in there and check your settings on your Google Voice number and have them uh, go any way you want. If you want your Google Voice to ring directly to your cell phone, like if you're using it for bandit signs or something like that, then you can certainly have it ring live. It's just kind of masking your real number with a Google Voice number. Great for bandit signs. But anyway, that's how to set up a Google Voice number. Pretty easy. And uh, if you have any questions, you can go to propertymob.com and click on Ask a Question and get your question answered.